And away we go. Ding! Now, ladies and gentlemen, the game starts to get a little weird. Yes, now the game starts to get a little weird. You heard me. down here, but now the music is more serious. Okay. That's probably what I would do. Back to the threshold. Whoa, whoa. Was that code? I don't know if I'm timed here. Ten nine fifty eight. save again because things are starting to get stressful let's reach out and touch some forgotten the password. God damn it. The living icon must survive if we are to finish our experiments. What the hell does that mean? We are pleased we await the live materials. We believe that the relationship between our race and yours can be very beneficial. I get the feeling I'm not supposed to do that. Like, <laughs> it really seems like they're just waiting for me. But let's do it anyway, just for fun. Nope, still can't do that. But let's try this card now. Maybe they'll go away if I use this. I'm sorry. Okay, I I don't I don't have a code I'm supposed to. Pardon? Oh no! That wasn't right. 
Well, we've seen this before. And dead. Is that it? I just had to guess it. Curtis, you're about to take one giant leap for mankind. Whoa, it's an escape room. Saving again. Definitely saving it. Oh, come on. Protected? What the fuck does that mean? Okay. I don't know what I just did, but I hope it's saved. I love this music. Very triumphant. This is probably gonna get me killed, but I'm gonna play with it anyway. Hello, small warners. We have not been successful in attempts to synthesize compound requested. Small living materials were useful. Look Our out! Are better. More, please. Don't know, Curtis. Hello, Paw. Creatures from Dimension X, of course. Cool. You got that from the Ninja Turtles, didn't you? You killed my father, didn't you? He became a liability. Not everyone is strong enough to handle the sacrifice of human subjects for research. You son of a bitch. You know, it's a good thing your dear old dad never knew he didn't really get his little boy back. He'd have lost his nerve much sooner. What did you just say? What are you talking about? Don't you remember? I threw poor little Curtis in there. But he never came out. You did. You're a replica. You're some kind of imitation human. Those things on the other side put together out of slime and dead rats. And a little bit of Curtis's brain tissue. Oh, I told your father it was you, that there'd been a terrible accident, and he believed me, because he wanted to. No. Yes, I'm afraid so. You started remembering a year ago. That's why we put you in the hospital, to observe you. I should say to observe you more closely. You see, we've been watching you like a bug in a jar. Ever since those things spit you out of the threshold, where am I? Where is he? There he is! Oh. Ooh! Hi! Who will allow me to introduce myself? Curtis Craig, at your service. Uh. <laughs> I just love the casual look here. Down, 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 down. This is probably gonna kill me. Oh my god. No, that can't be. You are a slow, glad exoplasm. What you see now is an electrical projection. A manifestation of my hatred slime. My body, my human body is in there. It is a twisted, wretched mess kept alive by the cannibalized body parts of course. Those amorphous things just go about their lives all around me, combining, recombining, playing with the monstrous things that warn against them. They never even touch me. Oh God, I'm so sorry. Are you, are you sorry that my body is a sickening apparition? Are you sorry that I haven't slept for 20 years? I'm gonna wait, Curtis. What you do? Go 
wielding my powers so that I can smash you, destroy you, take your life the way you took mine. Well, you know what? You're being kind of a dick. Just gonna say it. It wasn't my fault. I didn't do it to you. I... I'm a victim, too. Oh, Bailey. Your pain will stop very soon. Once your mind breaks, your body will be fine. I almost got you, you know. When you're in the asylum. Almost. No. No, don't! It's time to go now, Curtis. Say goodbye to your sanity! <laughs> Threshold! Whoa! Curtis? You have gone where no geek has ever gone before. I wish I could override it, but it won't let me change it. <laughs> I mean, I guess technically this is his home. All right, everybody. Well, thank you so much for joining me. We are very close. We are very close. And it's going to get even weirder. <laughs> I promise you. <laughs> oh, God. If you're even still watching this, I thank you so much. This game is just so stupid and so ridiculous. But it's such a microcosm of uh, what the time was with regards to science fiction and what people thought was scary. <laughs> anyway, um, my name is Colonel 006. I'll be back soon with more. Take care.